This video lesson is about adding and subtracting similar fractions. Similar fractions are fractions having the same denominator. 15 over 20 and 7 over 20 are similar fractions because they have the same denominator. And their denominator is 20. Here are the steps on adding similar fractions. So first, add the numerators. Two, copy the denominator. And three, express the lowest term if necessary. So let's try an example. So I have here eight over 10 and five over 10. So we're going to add the two fractions, the two similar fractions. So the first step is to add the numerator. And the numerator are 8 and 5. So 8 plus 5 equals 13. Step 2, copy the denominator. The denominator of the 2 is 10. So we just only copy the denominator. And 3, express the lowest terms if necessary. But 13 over 10 is in the lowest term. So we don't need to lowest term the fraction. So let's proceed to example number 2. So again, add the numerator. The numerator are 3 plus 3. So 3 plus 3, it will give you a 6. Step 2, copy the denominator. And the denominator of the two fractions are 5. And last step, express the lowest term if necessary. But again, 6 over 5 is in the lowest term. So let's try another example. Example number 3. So I have here 4 over 8 plus 2 over 8. So first, add again the numerator. The numerator are 4 and 2. 4 plus 2, it will give you a 6. And step 2, copy the denominator. And the denominator of the two fractions are 8. Step 3, express the lowest term, if necessary. This time, 6 over 8 has a lowest term. We divide it by their GCF of 2, which is equivalent to 3 fourth. If you want to know how to find or how to lowest term a fraction, just click on the suggested below, just suggested videos above on this video so you can get on how to find the lowest term or to get or to change the fraction to lowest term. And for this example, since 6 over 8 has a lowest term, we divide it by their GCF of 2, which equivalent to 3 4. So the answer for these fractions is 3 fourths. Steps on subtracting similar fractions. So just like addition, we only first subtract the numerators. And second, copy the denominator. And the last, express the lowest terms if necessary. So just like the addition in this uh, category, we just only two need to subtract the fraction. So let's try an example. So again, subtract the numerators. And the numerators for this is 8 and 5. So 8 minus 5, it will give you a 3. 
and we just only to copy the denominator and the denominator for this fraction is 10 and last express to lowest term if necessary but 3 over 10 is in the lowest term so we don't need to lowest term the fraction so let's proceed to the example number two so again subtract the numerators for this example the numerators are nine and five so nine minus five it will give you a four and copy the denominator for the step two and the denominator for this fraction is 20 and express it to lowest term if necessary 4 over 10 has a lowest term we divide it by their gcf of 2 which which is which is equivalent to 2 fifth so the answer for this fraction is 2 fifth because 4 over 10 has a lowest term and the lowest term of 4 10 is 2 fifth so last example for the subtracting a uh, similar fraction so subtract the numerators and the numerators for this is 4 and 2 so 4 minus 2 it will give you a 2 and we just copy the denominator so the denominator for this is 5 so 2 fifth is in the lowest term so we don't need to get their GCF try this one add or subtract the following fractions so I'll give you a 20 seconds to answer to this fractions and after 20 seconds I will give you my answer and check your work so your 20 seconds starts now seconds five seconds time is up so here is my answer so check with your answer so my answer for number one is one fifth number two 13 over 10 number three one over nine number four five over 21 and number five four over three take note the number one and number five expressed in lowest terms since they have lowest terms so how many points did you get congrats See you on my next lesson.